What's going on, everybody? It is Friday. I'm taking a little late lunch today because I was handling some uh, work stuff and kind of lost track of time. But we did get an SGC order in. But real quick, uh, tonight I'll be live between 7 and 8 p.m. And then I saw messages popping on my sheet on my phone. And I'll be opening up. I don't even know where I put the box at now. Somewhere in here, there's a 92-93 archives basketball hobby box. Um, yeah, no idea where it went to now. It was in my hand, and I just lost it. I was going to show you guys the picture of it, but I don't know where it went. It made, oh, there it is. Underneath the cardboard I had here. Opening this up tonight. Kind of cool. Be looking for the old Shaq rookies and uh, the Jordans out of this. So come by. Uh, we'll have some stuff for sale, like always, too, for wax if anybody wants it. And then I will have the store loaded up with everything that's to my right here because I got more stuff in the mail today. So that is my goal. Last night it was just a longer night than what I wanted to do to begin with. So I kind of cut it short and didn't really list anything in the store. But same thing as last time. Small flat rate box bubbled out. Um, yeah. Like I said, I, I won't be using these guys again after these next two orders. This is just, I don't like the way they ship it. Man. At all. There we go. It just leaves so much room for error for a card to be damaged. Oh my god. And normally I probably would already would have pre-opened some of this part of the way. But uh just in case it was damaged, I want to make sure everything was on camera. This time we kind of got the tape off in one little foot. Almost, almost. I lied. Yeah, we'll use the bubble wrap again. And our bands, of course. Just gonna arrange them here real quick. Oh, you got nobody important calling. I think I'm missing something here. Let me look at my sheet. Didn't feel right. Hmm. No, I guess I didn't. Okay, I didn't remember the order to be honest. We did much better on grades this time. Much, much better. So, starting off, I sent this in. It was a paper um, from Bowman. This is the rookie card, Mr. Lubob himself. He got an SGC 9. I kind of figured it was because of the centering left and right here. And then as you can see in the back, but I wanted to see how much they gig compared to PSA with the backside. So very heavily. Ooh. All right. Tyler Harrow, 9.5. This is the rookie from Mosaic. Dude is hot right now. So kind of happy I got this back, being a 9.5. Uh, beautiful card. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Up next, this is the Prism uh, Fast Break version with the little sparkles. Jackson Hayes, this is the variation jumping. We 9.5 did as well. Really cool. Mint Plus. Very happy. Um, like I said, I looked these over pretty good. The, the paper was where I was kind of curious at on this one. Up next, Kyle Guy. We tend it. Number 33 out of 50. This is the Purple Fast Break. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Ooh, let's do this one next. This was another paper. This one here I knew was centered a lot better, so I sent it in. Uh, for, this is like for real type deal. Uh, Alvarez, this was a 10. It's a lot better centering than it was on the Lou Bob. 
So pretty cool for Alvarez offhand. And finally, uh, nine five ten auto fast break PJ Washington. Once it wants to actually look at it, there we go. So nine five ten onto it, pretty cool overall with sticker auto. It's kind of seeing. If you guys look here, I was kind of curious where they were going to give this because see the smears in the auto. That in Beckett land, it's automatically a nine. So it was a test. I'll take an auto grade to a ten. No doubt in my mind on it. So pretty cool overall. Um, six card submission. Like I said, the first couple I was doing was test to see how well the cards would grade, where, where the real uh, where they're going to be leaning at on certain things. So not bad at all. Very happy with the results of the grade. Just the shipping, the timeline, just forever. Um, let's do something different here. So. I'm going to use this video here as a contest. Contest. So in the comment section, I think some people have done this before. On Sunday, the contest starts now. It will end Sunday at 12.59 p.m. That is one minute before 1 p.m. So Sunday is September 27, 12.59 p.m. That's in the afternoon, right before the 1 p.m. game start. I want you to pick the winner between the Pittsburgh Steelers and the uh, Houston Texans. And then put what the final score is. So an example, you can put whatever you want in your comments. At the end, you can say Pittsburgh, which means Pittsburgh is going to win, or Steelers, you know, 21 to 10. And if that is the final score and you pick the right team, I'll give you this uh, Lou Bob right here, SGC9. So in the comments section, you can make any comments you guys want about SGC and all that stuff. But somewhere in your comment, put down, you know, which team you think is going to win. Steve starts Sunday at 1. So one minute prior to that game, start is when no more, no more entries. Only one winner. Two, only one winner. So you guys need to look at everybody else's uh, picks on here. Because whoever put the first comment, so say like I picked Steelers 21-10 and then John Smith uh, like five hours later picks the same score. That second score is voided. It's the first person who picked it. I'm not running like multiple randoms and stuff because 10 people picked the same exact score and it hit. So... Um, all you got to do is pick the winner of the Steelers and Raiders plus the final score. Of course, the high score will be the winner of the game, which you chose either Pittsburgh or Houston. Really easy to do, kind of cool. So I'm going to start probably trying to implement something like this once per week in a video. It can appear anywhere on it. So that way it's never going to say contest on the video, giveaway, nothing. It's for everybody that sits there and takes their time to watch these videos, which I do appreciate. So we'll start off this week, Steelers and Texans. Um, get in before Sunday. That's September 27, 12.59 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And tell me who you think is going to win the game in that final score. And we'll just keep doing this uh, throughout the week. Maybe we'll start doing a Thursday and a Monday night games, too, and stuff like that. We'll see how well this takes off and stuff. But if you pick the right score and you're the first person to pick that score, this is your card. I'll get in contact with you if I don't have your address and mail it right out to you. Other than that, everybody, thank you. I will see you live tonight. Um, if you can't make it, uh, please have a safe weekend out there. A lot of protests and rioting going on, especially in my area up in Louisville. You guys probably have seen. But I will be live tonight. We'll open that box up. We'll get some people in the room. Uh, I think somebody does want that other Labor Day box, so we'll, if they come on, they can grab it and stuff like that. But other than that, take care. Have a good weekend if I don't see you tonight. And uh, look for, well, looking forward to opening up that basketball tonight. Really, am. Yeah, it's one of the older products. See how well the cards are. All right, see you all tonight if you're there.